right, there we go. All right. What's up, everybody? It is DK here. Welcome to Focus Friday. It is the 21st of July, and we are on the verge, the doorstep of the August Blitz. Blitz. <laughs> yes, we have a blitz coming up in the month of August. So make sure you stay tuned, get all the details here. It's going to be more coming up in the next week or so as we get ready for the month of August. So welcome to the replay, guys. You guys are over on teachabletuesday.com if you're watching this portion. So if you're here in the channel, make sure that you go ahead and hit subscribe and also ring the bell, get notified anytime new content is posted here, which is every single week. That being said, I'm going to jump into the Facebook group. So just bear with me as I go ahead and share this and we go live into the Facebook group. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Group. Let me make sure I grab the right group. There we go. Boom, pow. All right. We are officially going live, my friends. Officially going live. There we go. Boom, boom. All right. And head on over here. Check out the group. Look at that. All right. Here we go. Awesome. There we go. All right, give me one second, guys. Just got to get this pushed out. Send the old uh, push notification out from the app. So there we go. Boom. Live now. All right. Sending away. All right. Now do me a favor. Once you guys hopefully get the push notification, go ahead and comment the word push uh, down below and let me know. That would be super cool. And uh, that'd be awesome. So give me one second here. Can you... One of you do the e tag, please. All right, there we go. All right, my friends, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are officially live. So it is Focus Friday, and uh, we got a really, really important message to talk about today. We've got a couple things to talk about today and gearing up and getting ready really for the rest of the year, uh, not only here with the funnel team, but with Savings Highway Global and you and your income, your future, your potential, everything. Uh, we're going to talk about that a little bit today and how we can really help you guys get cranking away and maximize the month of August and really maximize this business that you guys are in right now. So just like we did in the month of May, I had to think there for a second, we did a blitz and we talked about this on Teachable Tuesday. And as a matter of fact, on Teachable Tuesday, if you guys, for whatever crazy reason, for whatever crazy reason, if you missed Teachable Tuesday this past week, you should head on over to teachabletuesdayreplays.com and go check that out because there was a, a massive, massive nugget right in the middle of that Teachable Tuesday where uh, Kirsty unveiled how much money she actually made in the month of May. And the number, if you haven't seen it already, will blow your socks off. But the reason why we shared that, guys, is so you could see what's possible. Like real, like real life number, real life, multiple, multiple, multiple five-figure monthly income. That's what's possible. And that's what we're going to dive into today. And I really want to share this important lesson with you because I, I think that a lot of times we take this sort of thing for granted. And that specifically is the cost of inaction. In other words, not doing anything, like not taking the action necessary and required of you to get off your butt and go start generating leads and sales. Because watching video after video after video and taking no action I want you guys to understand this. This is so critically important. Your habits over the last month, three months, six months, nine months, year, two years, whatever it is, your daily habits have led you to where you are today right now. And that's the truth. It's not anybody else's fault except yours. You're where you are today right now because of your habits, all right? And maybe some of those habits are not taking enough action, not trying hard enough, not being willing to figure things out, to go for it, to do it. Because you see, a lot of us 
we almost get there. We almost do the work. We almost put in the effort. We almost work hard enough to see a result. We almost try hard enough to figure it out. But when the, as you hear, when, you know, when times get tough, what do people do? They quit. Why? Because it's easy. Quitting is easy. Giving up is easy. That's why everybody does it. That's why so many people give up and quit because it's easier to quit than it is to keep going. Okay. And this is also really important too. Human beings are addicted. A little psychology for you. And guys, almost every time I come on and I do a live presentation or a Facebook Live, a Mindset Monday, or whatever it is, I always try to give you a little psychology and a little lesson so you just have a better, deeper understanding of what's really going on. Like, why do you make the decisions that you do? Why do you take or don't take the action that you do or don't, right? So I want you to think about this. The psychology behind a lot of this is it has a lot to do with whether you're willing to put in the work or not. Because again, quitting is easy and human beings are addicted to being right. So it's easier for maybe you or some of the people in this room, some of the people watching this live webinar right now, it's easier to give up and quit so you could be right. And you could validate for yourself. And maybe when you talk to friends or family, or maybe when you're talking to somebody online, you'd be like, yeah, that's too difficult. It's too hard. It doesn't make sense. It, whatever, insert your excuse there. And congratulations, you're correct. Great job. Woohoo. But where are you? Where did that habit, that behavior, that thought process, where did it get you? The only place it got you to was checking the box and being right. It didn't get you a result, didn't ge generate you a lead, didn't generate you a sale, didn't generate you any money, didn't build your business, didn't help your family. But congratulations, you're correct. It's hard. It's difficult. Whatever excuse you want to use, congratulations. Guys, I shared a post earlier today, earlier this morning, and I want to share that with you guys right now because it's really, really important. All right. So I'm going to share my screen here in just a second. And I want to show you guys this post. I want to read it to you so you can kind of understand really the importance of what I'm talking about here. Okay. So let me take this. Let me share my screen. So I just posted this in the group today. If you haven't read this, what I want you guys to do, you have to do it right now. Wait till this is over. But I want you to go to this post and I want you to drop a comment. Now, I'm not going to tell you what to comment. It's easy for me to say, hey, everybody go to this post and comment in it to win it or comment, you know, insert here, whatever. I want you to go to this post and I want you to read it. And then I want you to read it again. And then I want you to comment something based on what you feel. Okay. Give me the truth. Give me honesty, but don't give it to me. I want you to declare and claim something for yourself. Okay. So if that makes sense, that direction that I'm giving you right now, comment makes sense down here right now on this live right now. Okay. Don't go to the post and comment makes sense. I want you to comment makes sense right now. I want you to go to this post. I want you to read it. Then I want you to read it again. And then I want you to comment what you feel. How does that make you feel knowing and understanding if you don't take action, where that leads, where that pathway leads by not taking action? So let me read you the post, okay? If you see someone failing to take action, it tells you that they don't know the cost of inaction. Just because the cost of inaction is invisible doesn't mean that it's not real. What happens if you don't take action? Nothing. The cost of inaction is status quo, meaning everybody does it. If you're okay where you are, 
then you don't need to do anything. However, if you want to get to the next level, you need to understand the cost of doing nothing. Action is expensive, but inaction costs a fortune. So go read that post, then read it again, then drop a comment. Let me know how you feel, okay? But I want you to understand the importance of why I'm sharing that with you guys today because <coughs> you guys got to understand what happens by just doing nothing. I want you to understand, again, more psychology here, that if you start this business and then you don't take any action and then eventually you just quit, that's your cycle. That's your repetition. That and those are the habits that you have created because I'm willing to bet and I would put money down that this is probably not your first opportunity. This is probably not the first time that you have given up and quit only to go start something else and do it again and again and again and again. And the lesson here is to not quit. The lesson here is to figure it out, to find a way to take action versus inaction. Now, let me give you guys a really, really, really important lesson here. I've been speaking with, you know, some of my team members and hear me out when I say this, okay? And some of you are more talking direct to you. I get that we all have life. Everybody's got life. Everybody's got situations. Everybody's got circumstances. But it's what you do in those moments that really and truly matters. You can take a circumstance, a situation, a challenge, and you can make something of it or you can let it define you. Now, some of you have let this define you. So what do I mean by that? Some of you guys might be at platinum or titanium, right? And you guys are out there trying to build and grow your business. Maybe a life situation, a circumstance, a situation happens and you say, hey, I got to take a step back in my business. I need to go from platinum to titanium. I need to go from titanium. Oh, sorry. I need to go from titanium down to platinum, or I need to go from platinum down to gold. And you need to take a step back. If you're going to let that situation define you, hear me out when I say this. No one in the history of ever takes a step back to take a step forward. The key is to keep moving forward. Because if you step back, you're allowing that situation or circumstance to define you and who you are versus rising above and continuing fighting, chipping, scraping, and doing whatever you possibly can to keep moving forward and finding ways to win. Three Xing, 4Xing, 5Xing down on your hustle, your attitude, your mindset, whatever you got to do to keep moving forward. Because I, again, I've been doing this for a very long time, guys. And in the entire time that I've been doing this, I have never, not once, not once ever seen someone step back only to emerge as a champion or a leader or whatever down the road. It never happens. Because when you step back, you're giving in. And that's the truth. So I want you guys to think about right now in this moment, doing whatever you possibly can to find ways to win. Find ways, strength deep down inside to keep moving forward. It's the only way to win. It's the only way to get yourself to that place, to that position where you can be reaching your goals. You can be reaching that, the whole reason why you joined in the first place. So let me ask you guys this, right? Let me ask you guys this. Everybody comment below. 
in one sentence. Give me one sentence. Why did you join? So whether you're watching live here on the Facebook group now, you're watching on the YouTube channel, comment right now. Why did you join? Why did you join? What's the reason? Put that into one sentence if you can, okay? Why did you join? I know why I join. And I can sum it up into one word. One word. Freedom. Freedom. That's why I joined. Freedom from a job. Freedom from having to worry about bills. Freedom. Freedom lifestyle. Being able to go where I want, when I want, with who I want, because that's what I want to do. That is freedom. And it is a, it is a beautiful, beautiful feeling. Okay? So a lot of you guys are saying financially free, right? More joy, okay? Extra money to help the family, freedom from the time clock, yep. Be yourself, time freedom. Yep. Double my income, leave my job, supplement my retirement income, financially independent, get out of debt. Yep. So guys, you need to you need to take that feeling. Think about the feeling when you think about what freedom would feel like. What would it feel like to be completely out of debt? What would it feel like to double your income? What would it feel like to never have to worry about your bills? What would it feel like to just get up and go on a vacation whenever you want to get up and go on a vacation? What would that feel like? That's the feeling you need to keep with you all the time and never let go. And not sacrifice that or trade that in. Because here's what you're doing. If you decide that you need to take a step back or you decide that you can't give it your all because of insert excuse here, you are now sacrificing and giving in and giving up on what you just commented, that feeling of freedom. You are giving up on that because whatever the reason is. And remember this, I shared this on Tuesday, guys, during Teachable Tuesday, okay? The only reason, the only reason that you can't achieve your goal, that you can't achieve that freedom is the BS excuse that you give yourself as to why you can't achieve it. That's it. That's it. Your success in this industry, and this is, guys, this is why I talk about mindset and psychology so often when I come on live with you guys, because it's, it's literally everything. It is literally everything in your business. A lot of times we get wrapped up and consumed and concerned about the technical. Well, TikTok this and YouTube that and cap cut this and cap cut that and editing my videos and oh no, like, you know, here's a common concern. Oh no, my videos only get 10 views or 20 views or whatever it is. Go make better videos. That's the solution. The solution isn't to quit. The solution is go make better videos. That's it. Like, do you realize how simple it is? Because when your mindset and attitude is right, when your mindset and attitude is dialed in, all the excuses fade away. All that stuff fades away. You don't worry about TikTok and views and accounts getting shut down and videos getting banned or you only have a few views or how do I edit this or how do I do that or well, whatever. All that stuff fades away when your mindset and your attitude is in the proper alignment. When you open the doors and you allow doubt and fear and frustra frustration and worry and other people's opinions, when you allow all of those things into your mind, that's when all the other stuff starts to take shape. Quitting, giving up, thrown in the towel, it's too hard, insert excuse here. It's why we talk about mindset and psychology so often here in this group, because how important it really is. Now, we are on the doorstep of August, guys, and this coming Tuesday, as a matter of fact, I want to get a lot of you guys registered now, okay? So I'm going to drop the link down below, 
I want to get a lot of you guys registered now. We have a very, very, very important Teachable Tuesday coming up, right? Very important Teachable Tuesday coming up. So make sure you guys go get registered. We're going to be going over the August Blitz. We're going to be going over, you know, step by step how that how that looks, what that looks like for you. We're going to give you an actual roadmap, things that you can do each and every day to go make August your best possible month. End of story. Okay. So make sure that you guys are in attendance on Tuesday as we go over this and just know this. August, my friends, mark my words right now. August is going to set the tone for the rest of the year. Okay. What you do in August is going to set the tone for the rest of the year. End of story. All right. If you put in the work and you follow along and you do what we say, you're going to have a great rest of the year. And that's going to set you up for massive massive success. Okay. The fall, October, November, December is the best time and the most lucrative time of the year in this industry, in this business. And what you do in August really does matter. Okay. So if you want to sit back and chill and only kind of put in the work or sort of put in the work or try a little bit, then you're going to maybe get a little bit of results. But while everybody else is chilling and grilling and on vacation and relaxing in the month of August, getting ready for the kids to go back to school, when you three, four, five X down on your business, you're going to be light years and leagues ahead of everybody else. So your goal your only goal in the month of August right here on this team should be to outwork everybody else, okay? And we're going to give you some very, very specific examples as to how you can do that. You just need to be willing to go do it. But I can promise you, I can 100% promise you that if you put in the work and the effort and you go after it better, faster, harder, stronger than you ever have before, it will pay in dividends come the fall. You will be so much further ahead come the fall. You will create massive, massive momentum in your business as we head into the fall. All right. So make sure you guys are there for Tuesday and make sure you guys are gearing up and getting ready for the month of August because my friend, it is going to be awesome. We have so many new things headed your way. As a matter of fact, I just, as I was on live right now, I just got a message from, uh, one of the editors working on our brand new team sales video. So we're going to have that to you live as we head into the month of August. So very, very exciting things coming your way, my friend. So make sure that you are staying right here in our Facebook group, staying plugged in and taking massive action, my friend, because you are 100% worth it. All right, guys. That is it for today. Hope you guys got massive value from today's Focus Friday. If you guys are over on the YouTube channel, make sure that you guys put a hashtag replay down below. If you catch the replay here in the Facebook group, again, put a hashtag replay down below. But that is it. Go ahead, get registered for Teachable Tuesday, my friend. And we will see, um, see you guys really, really soon. Have an awesome, awesome weekend. Get ready for Tuesday and get ready, my friend, for the month of August because it's going to be awesome. Catch you guys soon.